What's happening? Crypto fam, happy, happy Monday. Good morning and welcome back to Love for Crypto. I'm Scott. It's a pleasure to have you here. I appreciate you taking the time out to consume the content, so thank you. Woo! This morning, I'd like to run through a little article I've noticed on Binance Pay. Binance Pay. <clears throat> I mean, these are gonna, they're going to be popping up all over the gaff, aren't they? And Binance, Binance are almost definitely going to do better than anyone else at first. You look, just look at Binance coin, man. It's absolutely ridiculous. Just the attention and and the market awareness that they've got. The the world's biggest crypto exchange. I don't care what any of you say. It's Binance. So this could actually change the game. Don't forget. Get to Redbubble and get your crypto merch, your love for crypto merch. Go get it, get your love for crypto mug, man. No messing about. And a t-shirt and all that. <laughs> Binance Pay coming soon, will it change? PayPal. The beta version of Binance Pay was announced a few days ago. This is a contactless cryptocurrency payment technology designed by Binance. From the presentation, it appears it has several things in common with PayPal. So much so that it can be said that Binance was probably inspired by the latter to design it. Binance Pay will allow users to pay and be paid in cryptocurrency by friends and family all over the world. In order to use it, it will be necessary to have an account on Binance.com, download and install the app. This will allow the user to create a unique nickname that will allow other users to easily send cryptocurrencies. The Binance Pay wallet will initially support six currencies, namely Bitcoin, Ethereum, Binance Coin, Swipe, BUSD and the Euro. You all know what I'm about to say. It can get fucked until it's got XRP. Why the fuck do I want to use that without XRP, mate? We'll carry on and then we'll run. The fact that it also supports the Euro and the stablecoin BUSD, which is pegged to the US dollar, suggests... Oh, get... Fucking cookies, for fuck's sake. It's pegged to the US dollar, suggests that it could also be used instead of PayPal. After all, these six cryptocurrencies are the same ones already supported by the Binance card, the exchange's debit card launched last year, which allows cryptocurrencies to be spent in fiat currency on the Visa circuit. Again, another thing I don't use, because why not? Yeah, you don't, not putting XRP on it, you absolute tools. In fact, Binance Pay can be topped up from the exchange's spot wallet. Indeed, the Binance Pay wallet is essentially the same as that of the Binance card. The app will also be equi equipped with a QR code that allows funds to be sent directly between two Binance Pay accounts. So what's the actual differences between Binance Pay and PayPal? The similarities with PayPal are many, but there is a substantial difference. In fact, although PayPal allows the buying and selling of cryptocurrencies, it does not yet allow the receiving or sending of tokens which can only be purchased, stored, and sold by the end of March. <clears throat> which can only, sorry, I missed the corner there, but they can only be purchased, stored, and sold on PayPal. Is that right? You can't, you can't send it to each other. Shite. By the end of March, the function of fiat currency payments powered by cryptocurrencies will also be enabled. But in that case, the recipient's receipt will be in fiat currency. In contrast, Binance, also allows both receiving and sending cryptocurrencies directly. The final goal would be to provide a service, a service dedicated in particular to merchants and those who want cash in cryptocurrency payments. Excuse me. But it's still too early to understand if this will actually happen. Not least, excuse me, not least because challenging PayPal from its point of view seems an impossible task unless direct payments in cryptocurrency were to become very widespread. I love how they don't mention an alleged protocol, they don't mention that, like, no mention of, of 
frictionless asset swaps, which we're basically already getting on uphold. Right, Binance is the biggest exchange in the world. Make no mistake of that, I'm not an idiot, I know. But, they're not the best. The best becomes subjective, doesn't it? The best at what? The best for what? The most currencies available, the best on and off ramp for low fees, the best this, the best that. Binance is absolutely shocking when you try to send money out of it. They even give you success and it still takes three hours. They lie. It's like they lie on a TX or something. It's bad though. It's bad. Uphold. As soon as Uphold's card comes in the UK, Binance, I mean, I don't... <laughs> It's not like I'm just going to end up shitting all over it here, but it, <laughs> you want, if you're a fan of Binance, this is great. And I, I don't want people watching this now to think, fucking hell, he's just done that about that and, he, and he's absolutely shitting on it. I'm only shitting on it because I'm not a massive fan of Binance, but let's have it right. This is still massive for the space. It's massive for the industry. It's big. It's big. It's big. Do you know what I mean? It's... It's just not as big as, <clears throat> for me, this news isn't as big or as welcome as the news of the uphold card becoming available in the UK is and the stocks and shares becoming available in the UK. You know, I'd rather just walk in Tesco with an uphold card and be able to spend anything from XRP to BTC to a Tesla and Apple stock on my Mars bar or whatever I'm buying your cash at the other end and all that paypal fuck off in a ledger payment pointers and apis dictating what the merchant wants in currency i throw any currency at him and he gets the currency he wants we spoke about this for years and they're still tiptoeing around it just get ilp enabled binance uphold is and it's amazing it's epic PayPal, just get ILP enabled, will you? Everyone, just get ILP enabled. It, do you know what it makes me think it, at times? It's actually going to take longer than everyone initially thought. People laugh at me when I say 2023 to 25 and beyond. <laughs> yeah, right, you won't be laughing in 2025. You're like, oh shit, Scott's got pretty much right, wasn't it? We all. Should have been a little bit more patient. The stress for years for fuck off. Binance. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna have a little bit. I'm gonna have a look for a little bit more on this one, sir. Because again, I don't want people to think I don't think this is a good thing. It's just I likely won't use it. Why would I? What's the point? point there is no fucking point so Binance Pay is a contactless borderless and secure cryptocurrency payment technology designed by Binance Binance Pay allows you to pay and get paid in crypto from your friends and family worldwide let us help you understand how this new crypto payment technology closes up the circle of our different users with the Binance ecosystem with the crypto lifestyle you always wish for. ILP payments is what I've wished for, dickhead. So where the fuck is it? Don't start telling me. Don't don't tell me that your shitty little fucking feature of your app is what I've wished for. You f <sighs> What? Live the crypto lifestyle you always wish for. How egotistical can you fucking be? To think that I'm, oh, this is all I ever wished for, this fucking Binance pay. Oh my God, I can't believe it's finally fucking here. Jesus wept me. In internet of value is what we wish for since being in the space. ILP enabled apps is what we wish for. Not some shitty Binance fucking pay.
everyone needs to get fucked anyway i'm gonna cover this again in a bit we're gonna go live about it so you know the dance you know the dance invest in yourself invest in internet of value live long and all that shit until you're ready to let it go and i'll see you on the next one yeah health and happiness to you and yours peace <laughs>